Pluggate World. Hey, uh, this video is proper to OCRefrigeration.com, OC Refrigeration and HVAC. Um, hey world, how you doing? Hey, this video is about uh, drain lines, true on true preparation tables. Uh, this is a two-door uh, preparation table. Um, you can get new drain line at Home Depot. This is the right, this is the, this is the size. So hopefully, uh, here we go with the freaking uh, video thing. See if it uh, focuses. So if I get it like a foot away. There we go, focus. Ten foot clear. Anyways, it's 5 8 OD, half inch ID is the uh, stuff. Let's see. Let's see if I can zoom and. Anyways, maybe it'll, hopefully it'll come out on the video. Anyways, 5 8 inch, there it goes, I think. It's got to hold it steady. 5 8 OD, half inch ID. 10 foot clear vinyl. Um, I believe I got it in Home Depot. Uh, you can probably get it at Lowe's too. Anyways, uh, True preparation tables are kind of notorious for them plugging up. This one got uh, like stuff plugged up in the drain. They plug up right in the drains and at the 90s and everything like that. So I got some new tubing. Uh, blew that one out. It's got a drain. Um, you want to be careful. Don't pull this one off in the case. You want to just pull the 90 out if you want to. I wouldn't even advise. I don't even take the 90s out. I just leave the 90 and blow it, make sure it's clear. Uh, you can break those things off, and the word they come off, I don't, sometimes they attach different places. Anyways, I don't recommend pulling this side out on the left. This one you can pull out, you've got to be very gentle with it. Um, it just uh, slides on the plastic fitting. They're really fragile, so, uh, and you can use a tube brush. Let's see if I got it right here. I use this tube brush to clean out the drain and that then it was all plugged up and it came flowing out you know so I redid the drain a little bit um, you run it behind the compressor and you have a thing in the back of the compressor and smashes it against the wall and I just don't dig it uh, so anyways um, I reroute them around front so as you can see with this one I did the line there and just put the new tubing. Did a straight run down here with the using the existing T. Um, and you got a tube brush out, anyways. And I run them right here. Uh, a couple wire ties. I don't use just one wire tie. I use two because if one wire tie were to fail, that thing would go in the condenser fan, and that'd be a bad thing. So, anyways, but then I put. If you can see. Um, do something here okay this is you see how I do that I two wire ties black which are UV rated so they're heat rated too so anyway so do the two wire ties there and then I uh, tie it to the liquid line you know which is a cool line which will run about 10 degrees above ambient um, with a <laughs> decent clean condenser you know it can run a little bit warmer but anyways um, so it can handle two wire ties again so it won't so if a one will fail one wire tie were to fail you know it wouldn't uh, pop into the fan but as you can see you should be able to see that we got let's see if I can light that fitting up a little bit oh, there we go there's the fitting and you can see we got we got loads of clearance I got tons of Tons of clearance there. So let me see if I can. Yeah, so. And uh, those are kind of deceiving angles, but you get. I got lots of clearance. You know, I got about an inch, uh, an inch at all times. So that's acceptable, you know. And uh, just got done cleaning the condenser on this one. Uh, so sorry, sideways won't work with the. Sorry, you guys. Uh, anyways, uh, yeah. Clean a condenser on that one. See if you can see through it. Let's see if the video 
come out. I don't know if it'll do it just for shits and giggles. We'll do that and see if it comes out. Anyways, anyways, uh, so I use the new bright uh, hot water it's out of a sprayer, pre-rinse, new bright scrub, and then uh, scrub the compartment this side along here, and scrub the compartment over here. They all get nasty down in there, so. Uh, clean all that area up, you know, and uh, generally clean it up, clean up the fan blade a bit, you know, because it's like a tire out of balance if you don't clean it up. So anyways, uh, so, all right, just uh, wanted to tell you guys about uh, true uh, drain lines and uh, how to redo them so they work a little better. All right, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, uh, hopefully like the video and subscribe. Thanks, bye.